this program wouldn't survive without the volunteers that come in every almost every day to work on these boats with these students. So we're so thankful to have them the there. Boat with Maritime Center and work with all my friends. They've been uh, great workers. We help each other a lot and can't wait to start my boat and our boat. Uh, very excited. Thank you. But uh, we, in the beginning, as John was saying, uh, when we were cutting all that wood and, and you couldn't really see the vision of a boat, um, we, we never thought that we would reach this. And um, with the hard work of not only the students, but um, the staff and volunteers, uh, we, would, we would really like to thank, personally thank um, Audrey Manning, um, mm -hmm. Chelsea, Brian, John, Greg, and Roger. Um, I can't say enough about this program and the experience that the kids have. Um, it's a tremendous joy. We've been working with uh, Buffalo Maritime Center for a number of years. And I know that um, what I enjoy most about it is that I get to see the growth of the kids, the learning process. And it's been wonderful. It really has. Right? Yes. yes. <laughs> Thank you so much. But I see here that Buffalo is represented in such a big way, in a way that we normally don't see Buffalo being represented, right? So we have some real, this is, this is the hard work of our students in action. We're actually going to see what our students have put together and whether it's Riverside or, you know, Lafayette schools in my district or St. Mary's School for the Deaf or Maritime Charter School. This is where...